in this video. I'm going to show you guys how to play ranked with hacks on without getting banned or reported. Stay until the end to figure out how. What's up guys, this is HJ back with another Roblox Bedwars hack video. And today guys, I'm going to show you guys how to use the most overpowered hack in ranked in Roblox Bedwars. And as you guys know, if you want to play ranked, it costs one Robux. But once you have that one Robux, you can hack without getting banned. So right now, I'm like Platinum 2, and it only took me 30 minutes. And you guys can probably get less than that because I it took me some time figuring these hacks out and how overpowered it is. And I'm basically going to show you how to get to, you know, Nightmare, Platinum, Diamond very, very quickly with these hacks on. So yeah, this is what I'm Platinum 2 right now and it only took me about 30 minutes of playing today. And yeah, I'm going to show you guys top to bottom about these hacks and how to use them all. So first things first. All you want to do is go to your settings and change your display name to she, S-H-E. What that's going to do is when you go in game, people in the chat, when you hack, it's going to be like, she is hacking, she is hacking. And they're going to have no clue who she is. And I think, in my opinion, that's a big brain idea. Like, you can never report it just by changing your display name to she, all right? He doesn't work because it's two letters. Make sure to change the location too, since if your name is in English, people might not know how to type your name. And yeah, that's basically it for the tip on how to get not get banned. And moving on, let's move on to the hacks. Now, I recommend working with a friend slash hacker in this ranked mode, since it's way faster and way more effective, and you have no time to report us if we win this fast. So basically, I'm going to explain every single one of these hacks. So as you can see, I'm using my shield as a sword and also auto blocking every single shot at the same time. And yeah, I'm going to explain every single one of these after this match. I'm just showing you guys how overpowered it can be. So be sure to listen carefully after this round is over. Now we have speed hack, we have uh, shield auto block, we have uh, kill aura, we have super jump right here, we have tracers, we have auto bed destroyer. And yeah, we just auto destroy every bed we get near to. We wipe every team, and there's only one team left now. <coughs> All you want to do is inject the script in the description right now, and I'm gonna go ahead and do that. After you executed the script in the description with your executor, it will say finish loading. Press right shift to open GUI. So what I'm going to do is press right shift, and basically this will pop up. Right here this thing will pop up on your screen all you want to do is cl click on every single one of these open every single one of these just by pressing the arrow right here and enable every single one of these i have on so hold on i have to win this game so enable everything i have on so like this auto buy is on auto heals on fast drops on anti void is on bed nukers on i have these on for a reason guys Trust me, and I have these some of these disabled for a reason because they are useless and they make you lag and they make you slower. So screenshot this or whatever you have to do to copy and paste it, and basically have all these on. Now I'm going to explain what every you know some of these does. Most of these aren't that important, but some of these are really important. So what it does is so first of all we have all clicker. It basically if you hold it, it's really really fast and combined with a shield. Is actually overpowers. So if you have this uh, auto clicker on, it says it uh, auto blocks right here. Press this on, and basically what it does is your shield is now a sword. So what I mean by that is you have to have the kits first. By the way, it's free this week, so I'm using it. But if you don't have it, it's fine. You can still have auto clicker on. So basically, my shield is a sword. I can hit people with it, but I can also block all the damage at the same time. And look how overpowered this is. Look how overpowered this is. It's like a freaking windmill just shredding everyone on their team. Yeah, that's basically what it looks like. It just rotates, blocks everything, and it's a sword at the same time. Now, that's basically what um, auto aim does. And that anti void saved me there. So I'm just going to get back on. So basically, what that saw, what you saw right there is anti void. It's one of the options right here. Right here. That's why I have on. 
it saves your life so much time so it saved me at least a hundred times already in the past 30 minutes what it does is it binds, basically bounces you back isn't that like amazing like you cannot die by the void unless you fall two times in a row but other than that uh, you're fine and anyways so let's get on to the last guy over here I have so much more to explain but my round is like finishing so fast with my um, friend right here hacking everything He's top three right now, and my rounds like end in like at least a minute. That's how fast my rounds goes, and you can get so much um, RP really, really fast. I'm already diamond one, and I haven't like grinded for at least an hour. I only grinded for like 30 minutes, and I'm diamond one. So yeah, basically this hack is overpowered. I have more to explain next round. Alright, next round, here I am, let us execute it again. And uh, next we have Scaffold. Um, this is pretty, really, like, important for rushing people. Now what Scaffold does is it builds for you. So where it is, where is it? Uh, scaffold is right here. So it shows it's disabled, but I put it to my shortcut V. So whenever I press V, it turns it on. So let me show you guys what that looks like. So you want to uh, find some wool, and once I press V, it says um, scaffold has been enabled, you can build, but once I don't press V, it doesn't build. So press V again, builds, V again, it doesn't build. Oh, I forgot to, it doesn't build, alright? So yeah, that's really, very, very important for rushing since it builds so fast and it is really, really useful. So yeah, set that to any keybind you want, it doesn't have to be V, it's just V for me. And yeah, that's basically how you rush people. This guy is using it too, my friend here, rank 3. Oh my goodness, this guy is a grinder, bro. Get your shield out, destroy everyone. You know the, you know the drill. Also, this is Ben Yuker, by the way. Once you get near to a bed, it auto-destroys it. And it's in the in your settings too. Uh, where is it, where is it? Um, ben Yuker is right here. Automatically destroys the bed around you. Really, really useful, recommend using it. Again, yeah, everything I have on has a reason why it's on. Everything I have off has a reason why it's off. And yep, I'm going to try to help him out over here. It looks like he got it. Got guys dead. Last guy is right here. Last two guys. This is insanely fast, guys. I have, I have to explain so fast each round because it the round ends in like within a minute. So I have a couple more, actually. It won't take that long, but video is almost over. So yeah, I have... Uh, let's see, what do I have? I have renders. I have, I have to explain all these and uh combat i have to explain combat all right next next round i'll explain right. it round three here we go uh let's see what we have this time we have render so all of these are just for tracing people down uh bed esp you can see through beds through walls and you can see their health you can see their what armor they're wearing what equipment they have um equipped so like you see my teammate right here it has a sword icon right here that means he has a sword equipped and you can see that for every single one of the players in this game. And next we have, uh, let's see, bow aim bot. Only have this on if you're lo looking for a long game, like a 30 v 30. And then after that, kill hour has definitely has to be on. Fast pickup definitely have it on. Uh, what's what's uh, no fall and no slowdown is really important. Make sure to have this on because this has basically what it does is when you get hit by an arrow or a sword, you have no knockback damage at all. So you can, you're just like a stone. You cannot get like knocked back. That's what you are. All right. So you cannot get knocked back with, um, you know, anything TNT. It doesn't matter. And then no fall damage. You already know what that does. You have no fall damage at all under any height. So if you're like up there spawn camping everyone and just airing everyone down, you will not fall. And then what do I have left? Let me kill these guys first with my auto aim don't have aim assist on by the way unless you're on controller because it just messes your aim up really bad so i have high jump yeah so i what i did right there was a uh, super jump super jump basically um makes you jump really high i my keybind for that is b when, when i press b so i'm gonna press b right here it high jumps really really high you can get high ground really fast or um you can hop over obstacles really really fast and my friend's here, so we just won the game. There we go. Yeah, GG's. So uh, be sure to join the Discord and uh, ask me any questions if you have any. 
Also, if you want that one Robux you do not have, you can join my group, link in description, and I can probably send you one Robux for free if you DM me on Discord, because I do have 3,000 group funds right now, and also I have like 3 hackers on my team right now. Also, be sure to team up with hackers, team up with other hackers, join other hack Discord servers, join the Vape of Vape4 and whatever script I'm using, they have a Discord server. And yeah, be sure to team up with uh, hackers because you will win very, very fast without getting reported. And yeah, I think that's all the tips I have for you guys today. Also, be sure to subscribe and like and have notifications on if you want uh, more tips or more hacks coming up. Because I have way a lot of Bedwars hacks in my inventory right now. And this is only one of them I'm using. So yeah, be sure to subscribe and have notifications on for more Bedwars hacks coming up. And by the way, um... Good luck on your rank ladder guys, it's kind of, you gotta be on the grind guys, don't give up, uh, team up, uh, play with your friends, try not to get banned, and yeah, thank you guys all for watching, I hope you guys have a great day, and as always, this was HJ, and peace out.